infiltrated a reconnaissance element within an area where an insurgent leader has been identified. Coming from your left, the Norwegian Surveillance and Target Acquisition Control is conducting a special reconnaissance by use of covered operations of a micro-armed air vehicle. Prior to the reconnaissance, they have been surveying the target area for seven days, providing intelligence, pattern of life, and target information to special operation forces. As a response to our artillery fire, the enemy executes counter-battery fires, shelling not only the prepared artillery areas, but also the most likely avenues of approach for our moving maneuver forces. The Norwegian weapon locating radar on your left determines the position of incoming artillery rounds. The section can detect both incoming and outgoing mortar, rockets, and tube artillery up to 40 kilometers. Corrective fire and accurate artillery it is necessary to use both forward observers and weapon locating radar in accomplishing his mission. Under the cover of own artillery fires, blue forces occupy hasty defense battle position to mitigate enemy attack. As a result, six multinational infantry companies occupy battle position from the north slope of Brody Hill near Cross Now will dismount from the fighting vehicles, occupy individual firing position, and at the same time anti-tank weapons crew will start preparing their equipment for engaging the enemy. From the left to right, in battle position, we have Romanian and Spanish companies at the North Cross Chinku, and in front of our tribune, we will have the police, Romanian, Albanian, and Spanish infantry companies, and the Norwegian surveillance and target acquisition battery on the left side of the tribune. The second Albanian infantry is composed of a company headquarters, three infantry platoons, and one heavy weapon platoon, consisting of, of 130 soldiers and six officers. Its mission is to be prepared and conduct combat and non-combat operation with the allies and partners. Cobra Company has undertaken many national and international trainings and exercises. 